Hello, I'm Christine and I have chosen to do a demonstration. Um, I have, uh, I use colour a lot. This is a still life that I've set up and time lapse. I'm showing you how I use colour. I've used the ground to set it up. It's a sort of greyed off green, which is a good neutral colour to start with. I'm then using warm colours. So you can see that there's orange in there, yellow, a pinky red. And I'm using colour as form in this exercise. So although I have used chalk to draw out some of the images, I'm not doing them in a realistic fashion. I'm actually just using the blocks of colour to create and build up the, the image, the picture. Now, from time to time, it moves quite fast, um, but really all I'm doing is showing you how I use colour. And I use it fairly much in a, in a pure sense. I don't do a lot of mixing and I don't do much diluting with water. So um, the paint I've used is primarily Matisse structure, but there is also some Atelier free flow paint in it and I do paint in a very um, free flowing style so although there are some lines in there to give me a bit of guidance I actually make up the colour and the shapes as I go along and once I've got a picture built up to a certain point like I have here where I've actually got some vessels and some flowers and I'm starting to fill in more of the background, then I really wing it. Um, so in the beginning there is the, uh, the, the outline of some of the uh, elements like the flowers and the bird. And then I, as you can see, I'm a bit freeform as I put in different shapes. Um, so it's a, uh, I, I, I often call my still life a construction because as I'm going along, I'm adding more and I'm looking across the picture plane to see that I'm keeping the colours moving around so that your eye will move around and follow them. You can see that there is a purple in there that actually moves across so that it's not all in one spot. Uh, and there's also um, yellow in the background and there's quite a strong uh, yellow in the, uh, in the, the hibiscus flower. Um, from time to time I will stand back and look carefully to make sure that I've actually got colours moving across the picture so that you will follow and take in the whole image. Thank you for watching. I'd love you to join my online class. Um, see you later.